Hey y'all, it's Jania and today I just wanted to pop in and make an encouraging video for you guys. I know that the world is going crazy right now, but hopefully this video can serve as some sort of encouragement or hope. The first point I want to make is, is that God is going through with us. In the Bible, in Deuteronomy 31 and 6, it says, Never will I leave nor forsake you, meaning that you're not walking through the trials and tribulations that you're facing on earth alone. God is literally walking through every single one of them with you that that serves as hope to me and it just proves that God is not a God that can't empathize with our pain he empathizes so much so that he will walk with us through our trials through our pain through our worries through all of it just to show that I mean he cares for us the second point I want to make is God can handle whatever you're worrying about whether you're worried about it not being enough bread at the store enough toilet paper because it's gone <laughs> Um, God can handle all of that. In 1 Peter 5 and 7, it tells us to cast all of our anxieties on the Lord because he cares for us. So whatever you're worrying about, you can give it to God because putting your worries in his hands is the best place for you to put them to actually see change begin to happen. And he cares about your worries. So some people may say, God doesn't care about what I'm going through. Yes, he does. He actually tells you to put your anxieties and worries on him because he cares for you. The last point I want to make is that trials and tribulations on earth point us to eternal life with Jesus. In John 3.16, it says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. I feel like when we go by living, you know, our day-to-day -day lives, we forget that eternity with Jesus is the goal. So trials and tribulations kind of uncover all of the distractions that we had and just serve as a reminder that Jesus is the goal. Heaven is the goal. That's what we're reaching for daily. Not everything else that we're, um, you know, getting caught up in money, fame, notoriety, goals, all of that. All of those things are great, but Jesus is the ultimate goal. And when things start to go wrong, it just serves as a, another reminder that that's what we're looking for. And that's what we're aiming for. For me, throughout this whole quarantine process, Jesus has been my only hope. I saw for myself that Jesus is the only thing that I can cling and depend on because everything else is temporal. Everything else is not going to satisfy. But if you're feeling like that as well, just know that Jesus is more than enough and he's all that we can cling to at this time. And he's the best person to cling to. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay safe. Watching Jess Janelle. Subscribe to her channel.